you believe it? Diamonds are the only things that can actually scratch a diamond at that hard. Imagine. All right, well, they do say diamonds are a girl's best friend. And that's why when they say they want you to put a diamond on that finger, they know what they're talking about. Uh, Mayomi Ogirengbe is in the building. She is someone who holds this all these facts to be true. She is a dynamic, innovative entrepreneur and a diamond connoisseur. She has a really aspirational story to tell, and she views diamonds as both a stunning accessory and also a wise long-term financial investment. Uh, she carries with her a wealth of insight and experience in this business, society, luxury, and culture. It's great to have you right here nice with us. You, Welcome, Miami. Thank you. All right. So, uh, Momo, it's a, it's a big deal to call you a connoisseur in, in any business. Yeah. Talk less of a, a diamond connoisseur. Okay. Uh, you need to let us in to your story. How did this all begin for you? Uh, so, um, I come from a family. I have a family background that is deeply rooted okay. in diamond jewelry. Okay. So, my mom has been in this business for more than 20 half decades now wow, okay. so uh she also has a store at the civic center and um growing up watching her be passionate about something like this you know introducing diamond is not a big i don't want to say it's not a big deal in nigeria although back in the days sure. people used to wear more gold our parents were sure. more familiar with gold sure. but i want to say she sort of introduced the diamond culture to the Nigerian industry, yes, or into the market. Mm. So obviously growing up, you know, with such an inspirational person yeah. and obviously it's, 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 it's very easy to, I don't want to say easy to walk in that lane because yeah. I actually studied business and finance. Okay. But at the same time, I've always, it's something I've always, not necessarily wanted to do, but it's just something I've always, it's always around me. It's been around you. I've been exposed to, to Diamond for, yeah. from, from the early age of what? as long as I can remember. So we saw some, some really interesting facts earlier on, billions of years old. Uh, yeah. So what is it? I, I know I've heard about you know, the science of it, okay. but what actually constitutes what, a, what is in a diamond or what a diamond is? I mean, it's literally just a natural stone. It's yeah. the, I mean, the value comes from how rare it is. Okay. It is extremely rare. It's a stone that you just can't find anywhere. It has to be specific place. And for it to be cultured, it has to be specific temperature as well. Okay. So like they said, it's the hardest substance. stone. Yeah, the hardest sub substance on earth. So I think that's one of the reasons why it's so valuable, you okay. know, and <laughs> also so hard to find. So you design uh, the pieces we're going to show on our, our fashion showcase today. Yes. Uh, we have some models here with us. Uh, hopefully they are standing by. Uh, but you, do you sketch these designs yourself or how does the process go? So I would say, say you walk <coughs> into the store and sure. you have a style in mind. Okay. Most times a lot of customers don't even know what they want. They just have what they want to wear. And... <coughs> go ahead. Sorry. Go ahead. And, you know, they come into the store... We, we bounce ideas off each other, and from there, from what they're saying, what they're thinking, yeah. sometimes they bring pictures, and then we start with a sketch. All right. You know, and it can be a very rough sketch, <laughs> but it develops into something more. Yeah, sure. Then we create a, 3, a 3D design, yeah. and then <laughs> we send it to our manufacturers in Italy, and sure. it Put develops it from there. Yes. Fantastic. So let's see what uh, model number one is wearing. I think she's adorned. Her neck is adorned uh, at this point. Uh, let's see how close we can get to the design on her neck. So uh, talk to us about this piece. Was this specially designed for someone? Yes, this was actually, it was designed, uh, for, obviously I can't actually mention the person on TV. Okay, sure, for, yeah. But course. yes, a so lady. it's made, a lady, so yes, someone of, you know, yeah. high stature. So it's, uh, it's made with um, 18 karat white gold. Okay. It has yellow diamonds. Wow. It has white diamonds and it has brown diamonds. A lot of people okay. don't know they are different you know, Types colors, of exactly, okay. of diamonds that they are. Mm -hmm. But um, obviously, we, we went with the, the color of fabric that she wanted to wear, okay. but it was a little bit too dramatic, so we wanted okay. to tone it down. Wow. Obviously, the colors mm -hmm. toned it down a little bit, but at the mm -hmm. same time, 
it's still vibrant. Okay. But not too flashy. So it comes with matching earrings. Yes. Um, but do you think of the personality of the person when you're drawing or sketching? Uh, so I go by what they like. You have a lot of customers who say they don't like anything too long. Mm. They want it like seated, which is like round. So we mm. go with that. And then okay. also the style of yeah. the outfit also matters a lot. So, I, so. I'm seeing these earrings though. Mm -hmm. uh, you mentioned white gold. Mm -hmm. Yes. That, that is a substance that's actually kind of quite heavy. Mm -hmm. If you could turn your head to the left or right. Um, I, I'm wondering about comfort. Okay. So when you're designing, do you think of comfort as well? Because this, these substances are quite heavy. Yeah, so we can, <coughs> it looks heavy, but we can make it as, as light as possible. Okay. So what really makes it heavy is the, is the metal, which is the gold. Sure. So the gold there can be as light as you want it to be. But yeah. most people that are going to spend money on diamond, yeah. they want to know that it's been mounted on, oh. on gold because, okay. you know, sure. gold is gold. So, sure. but there's a clasp at the back that actually holds ah. it in place that... Like, like yeah. how it's seated, you know. On her neck. Exactly. Okay, so I would love to, for her to turn, uh, if you could turn to the back. Because you obviously have to secure these clasps. Mm -hmm. At the back of the neck there, that is like a three-lock clasp right yeah. there. Yeah. That's three locks on it. Mm -hmm. Not like the usual costume where you just, you know, they just clip it once. All right. So I, I have to say thank you for showing us this particular piece. You're it welcome. looks extra special. But uh, tentatively... Uh, as an investment option, well, while we wait for the second model to come out, okay. um, as an investment option, okay. a lot of people, as you said earlier on, mm -hmm. invested in, in gold, yes. gold pieces. Yes. And they did, of course, pass them on to their children. Um, which uh, pieces are you familiar with that are, have been passed down, you know, over time? Uh, that when you were working with your mom? Uh, I'll say more diamond pieces okay. and gold. Okay. Um, obviously, I think once when you buy diamond, you're mm -hmm. thinking of it being, a, being something of a, like an heirloom. Yeah. You know, and it's so, there's also such a sentimental value that comes with buying diamonds as well. Okay. You know, <coughs> especially when it's specially made, yeah. you know, there's, there's a lot of sentimental values that comes into that as well. Sure, sure. And the fact that, like I said, when you're thinking about investment, yeah. these are things that the rarity yeah. is what makes it valuable. Okay. It doesn't depreciate in price. You know, this as piece we're seeing here yes. on this model here, for instance, mm -hmm. um, there, is there any way to differentiate just by looking at a piece, how rare uh, a piece actually is? Is there any way to determine? Um, unless you're a jeweler, okay. so I can sort of tell maybe what the, not necessarily the clarity, maybe the clarity. Okay. So I can tell whether it's a VVS, mm. I can tell whether it's a VS. Uh, let's I see can... how close we can go on, on that piece there. Let's see how, how deep we can go on that piece because uh, it has like a, a sort of drop down. It's, it's not teardrop yes. exactly, but what do they call this design? What do uh, they call it? I would just call it like a Y bar design. Okay. So it's, it's a form of a Y style. A Y style. So yes, okay. the different styles that comes is a single strand. This is double layered. Double layered. Yeah, a double layered dangling necklace, and it's wow. just it's just it's suitable for all kinds, all ages. Okay, there's a, a larger one in front there. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, is it in like millimeters? How do they measure the, the size of the stone? Honestly, it's just um, so once when when we draw it, it's yeah. based on how we think. Also, the aesthetics of it. You know, yeah. does it if it's too small? Does it drop down too quick? Yeah. You know, just in terms of proportion and yeah. how it works, and mm -hmm. it just goes as we you know as as the production sure you know starts and. So you also mentioned colors. Right. Um, so this particular piece we're seeing here, it looks like all the colors are very uniform. Yes. How are you able to get as uniform pieces like that? Because it just feels like because they're so rare, right. you might not be able to get all uniform colors mm -hmm. at the same time for a piece. Yeah, so we deal with... Our manufacturers are amazing. Okay. I mean, all our pieces are ethically sourced. That's number one. Okay, I was that's one of our, that That's one of our actually. biggest things. <laughs> so um, when we, we have a design... Let's see the next model. Let's see the next model. There's so when we have a design, we want to make sure what they have is readily available for us to use. So it's, it's yeah. very... So what we, they work with, they have different ranges of sh uh, shapes, yeah. sizes. Sure. So it's never a problem to get something uniformed sure. for a set that we want to do. All right, mm -hmm. fantastic. So who do we have here? Uh, what piece do we have here? Do you have names for these pieces? I was actually gonna ask uh, if you have names for not them. Necessarily <laughs> not necessarily, because 
<clears throat> no, we just uh, we 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 build them as as we see, and a lot of the times we we necessarily we don't even showcase them that much because we want them to be exclusive when the customers come come yeah, in. Yeah. So sometimes it's only our regular our VIP customers that okay. get to see something like okay. this. But um, all right. Mm -hmm. So uh, let's see uh, what this model is wearing. Ooh, look at this. How close can we go on this piece? I think we need to zoom in on this one. You said this doesn't have a name. I would like to give it a name. It looks like something royalty would yeah. wear. Okay. Um, I'm also thinking about, uh, you know, brides. Of course. Brides that want to really go all out for their traditional wear. Mm -hmm. maybe. And not just brides, mother just of brides. Mother of the bride. Mother of the bride. Okay, look at that piece. So I can see different color stones here. Uh, could you describe the, the stones we have? So we have an emerald stone, which is the green that you can see. Right in front. Obviously, the white is white diamonds, and we have blue sapphire. It's more of a blue sapphire set oh, wow. than an emerald set. But okay. the blue just, you wow. know, sparkles. It does what it needs to do. And the beauty of this is it can be worn like she's wearing this now yeah. on a dinner dress, mm. on a native. Yeah, native. A wedding, a, a, a traditional dress, yeah, yeah. you know, so that's just, that's, it looks big, but it's yeah. very versatile. Okay. That's okay. the beauty of our pieces. All right. So you drew this particular design yourself, mm -hmm. uh, then of course sent it to the manufacturers yes. to, to put together. Is yes. it on white gold as well? It's on white gold. On white gold. It's on white gold. Is there any type of metal that is not advisable for you to lay such stones? Um, I mean... I have seen people do diamonds and silver, but it's just not what it's not something that we do. We've always done 18 karat gold yeah. upwards. Right. So it's okay. either we do it on yellow, white, rose. There are different colors of gold that you can, as long as it's gold. All right. So uh, I was going to touch on the uh, investment aspect of things, but I think these stones are taking my breath away already. <laughs> um, but uh, in terms of, if I could compare, okay. is this a brand new car or is this a, a plot of land? Um, that yeah. we have here with us? Uh, it depends on the car. Ah, it depends on the car. It depends, Ooh, on, the car. depends on the car. Lovely. Yes. I love the way you put that. Yeah. Uh, but obviously certificates and all that uh, yes. all come with... All this. certified. Beautiful. Yes. It's great to have you here, Thank Miami. you so much, And uh, well done with what you do. Thank you. Can I have all three models step out uh, so we can get a, a shot with all of them uh, so that you can see how beautiful these designs are? Um, yeah, I think I'm, I'm, I think I'm in the wrong line of business. I think I need to start drawing me some jewelry. Mm -hmm. now, are you looking for staff? I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I can take on, I can yeah. do a, a, right. a partnership. A <laughs> partnership. Yes, no problem women, pa all. women power. So these look beautiful. Oh my goodness, I love it. The drop down uh, two layer one is calling my name. It's very you? Yes, yeah, very, that's me. Exactly. And uh, thank you to the models who have looked so graceful and elegant in these pieces today. All right, then. Uh, we have to appreciate you for taking out time to come talk to us. Thank you so much. It's a pleasure. Today's Fashion Friday Fashion Showcase has been bedazzled uh, by diamonds this morning. Uh, what are you going to be using to bedazzle your weekend? Mm. All right, we have a quick break and we will be back.